Alright guys, welcome back to some more Mario and Rabbit's Kingdom battle. So we have a little bit more. I think we're going to probably get through another third or so of the Lava Falls or Lava Factory, whatever the hell this... That's world. It doesn't tell me what world it is. Oh, last time we messed around with Mario's abilities and stats and got him a whole bunch of extra healing that he shouldn't have had. So we're actually not doing too badly. I want to make sure I actually reassigned his skills. I did. Alright, let's head into the next battle. Alright, defeat all. Alright, we got a lot of guys up over that way. Oh, we got a lot of guys on both sides. Okay. So we got supporters, we've got lava peekaboos. We've got more lava peekaboos, another supporter over here. These ones have an annoying tunnel system because it does not, they're, uh, they're a bit farther away from the exits. This set is within reach of this exit. I don't know if we can go from one to the other here though. Uh, we do have a ground pound guy. Oh god, we start, uh, actually really far. Um, hmm. Okay, then, uh, if we're gonna start that far away, let's keep, not do Peach. Let's do, I think, Rabbit Peach might be more useful, because she has that sentry. And, honestly, I don't think Rabbit Mario, I mean, there's a few enemies on this one, but, hmm. Peach Rabbit Luigi might not be bad. I mean, Rabbit Mario, like, you, you can't really complain. Like, he's got... He's just got so much utility. Alright, what can Rabbit Peach get? Let's clear everything off and reassign the skills from scratch. Now, having a high power dash and the cleanse jump is just guaranteed. We want as much pipe movement as we can... We want as many coins as we can. All right. We want healed more frequently. We can get a 70% heal. We can almost bump the range of effectiveness up as well. You know what? This is a 50%. Let's actually reset it one more time. I do apologize. But putting, I, I had the, I keep thinking the golden shot is like the best thing to always put on, but honestly, sometimes it's not. You can max out the heal, do that, give it one range of effectiveness, and then have, you, none of these guys are dashers. Do that, yep. And then the other one is Rabbit Mario, which we've got him pretty well set up, so, cool. Oh, actually, have I upgraded Rabbit Peach's weapon? Um, slightly better against regular Ziggies, but we don't really have any of them on this mission, so... And we already have that maxed out, so I think we're good to go. I think next mission's a mini-boss, too. So that'll be fun. Alright, let's do a fight. Alright. Well, I want to do... Alright, let's get Hero Sight on, because we're going to kill this guy down below us this turn. question is, are we going to kill him with the sentry, or are we going to just shoot him and then sentry next turn to draw everyone's fire? I think we can just shoot him. So this will draw him into the pipe. And then Mario will take a shot, which will piss him off at Mario, refresh his movement, get him enough points to get around the corner to get the second shot from Mario, and the finisher. 
And out of bounds, even. Alright. Now, do we have an ability... Oh, this is the top area is all connected. Okay. Then let's fling Mario as far as we can. Uh, those guys might... I don't think they have the range to get down to me and flank me. Let's get... All right, where can Mario go? Can you get all the way to that block, Mario? No, you cannot. All right. Send Mario on a mission to go kill these guys on the right. Uh... These guys can get through that pipe. I don't think that any of these guys can get through the pipe, and then the pipe again. No. Okay. So what I need is cover from the right. Alright. It's a lot more spread out of a map. Uh, we have 0% shots on anybody, and 0% shots on anybody. So, enemy turn. Wow, they have long-range weaponry. Okay, then. I did not think I was going to be vulnerable from down there. That should hopefully... Nope, that one did not miss either. Luckily, we have a heal ready for next turn. Damn, I did not expect a long-range fight like this. Stop shooting people! Damn it. Holy shit. Okay, did not expect this. Wow. Ooh, that was a push. Okay, did not move me very far. Then again, I don't think I've left Peekaboo's alive very much, so I think that's one of the reasons why I wasn't going to expect it. I was more worried about pipe movement, and it was... Oh, there's a grenade. So, Mario can get a dash here. Uh, there's a lot of guys to kill. I don't even know which ones to focus on. Alright, we'll focus on the lower group. Because if we're down in here, it gives us maximum mobility to other areas. Alright, so. We'll do Rabid Mario first, because that way none of us take the damage from all these slide ta- Holy shit, I forgot how big that range was. Then, we'll put ourselves here to draw them out, here to draw them out. Here we go. Look at all that scatter damage. All right. Now, if we do a draw, we might risk having... Rabid Peach not be able to slide tackle these guys. So let's get the slide tackle, the slide tackle, and then we want to sit in a position that Mario can reach. So Mario... Alright, we'll go with here. So slide tackle, slide tackle. It's not a 
really good protective spot. We're actually going to sit. No, no, it's a good spot to sit. We'll at least get Mario healed, I guess. I mean, the heals aren't super necessary this turn. And I think Reb and Mario might be in range. Ah, one square out of range. Damn. 70% HP heal, though. Do some damage here. Actually, fuck that guy. He's at full health, so doing damage to him isn't as beneficial as... No, we're gonna kill the other guy. Yeah, this is beneficial. hide here. Or here. Yeah, here. Kind of baiting a grenade, but I think we might actually be able to kill both of the supporters this turn. Alright, now we'll heal who we can. We'll gather these four together, and now they're all in range, then we'll smash them all. And only one guy is left alive. Oh, we got a crit on him though, did he? Nope, everyone's dead. That killed all four of them. So then we can send Peach's stuff up to... There's only two guys left. Peach doesn't have any actual shots, so we can kill either one of these. Let's kill that guy. And then Mario can't really use his power this turn, can't really take a shot, but that's fine. We're in pretty good cover. Oh, and that guy just chose the wrong spot to move, so he's dead next turn. Didn't even take a good shot. Alright, that guy we can reach from the pipe, unless he bounces me. Ah. Well then, that makes this more difficult. Alright, well, that guy's dead. So, it all comes down to killing this last guy. <sighs> Alright, so Mario can move to here. Peach can move to here. Kind of wish I had saved that now, but let's see what we can do. Rabid Mario can now get the jump. Oh, it's still 0% everywhere. If I go through this pipe, that doesn't get me any farther. No, it gets me no extra angles. And we don't have our draw out of cover ability, because we burned that last turn to gather him up for the hammer blow. So we'll put him in cover here. Can Mario fly far enough with the stomp? No. So what we'll do is we'll have her shield. He'll shield. I don't want him going anywhere near over here, so I'm going to use this to break the block. 
to remove his cover there. So now if he wants to come fight me, he either has to go down or up. That shot doesn't do us anything, so enemy turn. Damn, he found, like, the safest spot on the entire map. And now just move to the least safe spot on the entire map. And just pushed Mario into a very dangerous position for him. Alright, can Rabbit Mario make it to the pipe? Yes, we can. Bop. Kaboom. 100 damage. Is Rabbit Mario the one that needs the health? Rabbit Mario is actually the one that needs the health the most. That doesn't hurt Mario, so... Darn, we did not get the vampirism. Oh well, this should be the second mission of the set, so that means we get healed. Or is there a third mission? We get healed, okay, doesn't matter. You eat that pizza, Rabbit Mario. You enjoy that pizza. Yeah, we almost didn't have that last one done fast enough, but we managed it barely. We're gonna get some new weapons after that mini-boss coming up, though. All right, looks like another puzzle area for a bit. We don't have the drill, so we can't activate the button. Heart Blanche, which is a blank check. What are you doing, huh? Good to see there's at least one rabbit who's got his butt in gear. <laughs> Gosh, I'm on a roll today. Uh. Well, looks like we have a new weapon cannon. Is there a bike? Someone could have played bike polo on this at least, on this, or at least hung the wheel from their kitchen ceiling to hang pots from. <laughs> uh. Alright, take our digital challenge, or whatever the hell these are, special zones. Not even a hard one. Alright, whose weapon we get this time? Ooh, Peeper Reaper. When it comes to this melee weapon, it, it's an eye for an eye with an eye. I love how many different Mario enemies are referenced and stuff in these weapons and things. It's really cool. Alright, we're back here, so let's go this way. And to our next chapter. I think this will be our mini boss. Yep. Oh boy, it's a Bowser Jr. robot. Biggest pipe labyrinth yet. Seriously, how paranoid is Bowser Jr.? So many pipes leading to nowhere, and is that a mech? At what point do you just move to a gated community, you know? <laughs> There's only one way through this place that will lead us to Spawny. Let's watch our steps so no time to lose. There's no time to lose. Bowser Jr.'s lair. All right, well, actually, I want to go everywhere but the ending area. So, uh, yeah, let's work on doing that. So this pipe network will get me very, very close. So it looks like it just shifts things left and right, huh? Oh no! Oh, okay, it's assembly line kind of style. Okay. Alright. Now we just need to get the red one lined up and then we'll have that. There we go. First objective, Exploring the Mine soundtrack. Alright, then we need green. And red. 
red. This will get us out over on the side. If we go the longest possible way. Alright, we got some artwork. Mecha prototype. Oh, I wish there were cannons to send us back so we don't have to go through the stupid pipes again. Alright, now we work on bringing ourselves from the back. Okay. So, we need the yellow one switched around. Okay, now the green one needs to rotate. Okay, and we're actually done. Yep, that will actually get us all the way to the back end. Is there any other secret areas? Doesn't look like it. Um. What the hell? Was it this one that goes into it? No. That's connected, right? Like, the light turned on. Hold on, maybe it's a different red connection. Huh, apparently they just didn't have that animated, even though that was a valid pipe connection. Maybe there was a small gap, but I'm pretty sure that was still connected. The light turned on. Alright. 20 more power orbs, damn. Wait. Which way goes to Spawny? Oh, our goal is to go down the maze in the center there. I see it. The fact that it had the board over it was actually kind of camouflaging it a little bit. All right, let's... All right, blue is the key. Now, can we get yellow... And green to work for us here. Okay, that's not the solution. Let's try rotating the blue again. So there's only one valid connection to blue. That is the only valid connection to blue. So it comes down to yellow getting connected over. And is there no other valid connection on green? Okay, that one works, sorta. If a red one cooperates, the red one would not cooperate with I'm gonna do this just for the fun of it. Whee! And back to the start. Aha! That's how you do it. Alright. I was trying to connect too much around the loop. Didn't realize there were multiple yellow connections that were valid. Oh my, that is a big boss battlefield. Holy shit. Okay, we got lots of movement, lots of puzzle pieces. Um, well then. Defeat all. There's not even a mini-boss on this one. Oh, boy. Oh, it's Bowser Jr.'s room. Duh. Alright, we've got bucklers galore. Like, seriously galore. We've got one supporter.
All right, Mario and Rabid Mario can kill one of these guys. There's only five to defeat. All right, Rabid Mario is obviously a choice. Um, Rabid Peach has some AOE. Rabid Yoshi has a lot of dashes. Hmm, do we want a high damage vamp dash so we can kill a couple of them right off the bat with a super barrier? Or do we want the shield? With the sentry that'll distract them plus heals. Let's do that. And anything else? Wow, 70 more skill points that we can just throw around. Um, well, there's no high ground on this mission. So just put all these in. I wish you could just undo specific things, because you can reset the whole skill tree, so why not just undo specific ones? Let's take... I might get two uses out of this M power. Eh, there's only five enemies. Let's just buff the damn thing. And one range of effectiveness. Uh, what can we do? What can we do? Let's buff shield. And then she's pretty good. And then rabid Mario... Let's actually get rid of those bodyguard update upgrades and go with other upgrades. Keep that jump. Huge area of effect and huge damage on our explosion. Keep our movement. We're going to want movement in and out of pipes. I don't think we're going to get two uses out of Magnet Dance, so let's just buff Magnet Dance's range. And let's protect the shit out of him with Bodyguard. There we go. I think that'll work. Alright, always start with Rabid Mario. Boom, boom. Goes the dynamite. Awesome band. They did the uh, anime intro for Zammed. Which was quite a good show. Quite a good show. Hmm. Could focus on getting the two middle guys dead? No, we'll, we'll focus on the two middle guys getting damaged and then the side guy dying. And we'll go right hand side. is which way do I want him to move? Yes, we want to do it this way. All right. All right, then Mario can get one dash on one of these guys. No, we can't. Very well. We actually don't want him to do any dashes because his jump does more, and then we can have him sit here. Hmm. 
Oh, wow. Okay, she can't get damage on them either, so... It'll do quite a bit. Let's do her... Can we get her dash off? Because if we get the dash... Okay, we got the dash damage. That's all we needed here. Then Mario... We should have shot him with the shotgun before we moved Mario in. Actually, can Rabbit Mario actually hit anybody now? We actually have no line of sight of either of those groups over there. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Well, shit, can we sing them in? Hmm. Kind of wanted to use this next turn, but... All right, let's kill. Let's kill this guy this turn. That way Mario's 200 damage shot doesn't get wasted on 100 health. And we'll draw them in so that way I don't actually just waste my entire turn with the shotgun. Or we will just waste the turn with the shotgun and both of those shots. All right, inefficiency, thy name is Ghost. This guy's the one we have a better chance of getting a kill shot if we get the crit. And... That's only 122. Damn it. Or 222. We almost had enough. We have a heal if we need it, but we don't this turn, so we're going to shield ourselves. Because I'm assuming some damage is coming our way. And we'll let the enemies have their turn. Just going to blow up our cover. Yep, that's what I thought. Luckily, now she's out there with a shield. That guy can't reach us this turn. He's gonna heal, but he doesn't get that. Well, he actually has a half heal. Damn, he has heal. He has better heals than Peach does. And ow! Wow, he is uh, back to full health. All right, you're a dick. Um, but we're gonna kill you this turn, so that is fine. Park him over here. Okay, so he can't quite kill that other guy unless he gets a crit. Mario can go here for 130. Not get a flank on that guy. All right, we need that guy dead before we can use this on him. Or just move first. Oh, she's one square away from hitting that guy. Do 
Does that blow that cover up? Let's take this shot first. Ooh, that becomes a very dangerous cover to be by. That's an ink blot. And that does not turn him from Mario. So I actually want to be back here. First, let's buff her little thing. And I guess we'll hide behind this cover over here. Hmm. Guess we should have kind of split up. Alright, this will hopefully take his shot. Heal everybody, because we can. Reduce any damage. I don't think that guy's going to get anything on us, but it doesn't hurt to use the ability. Can we get around him this way? No. We don't have sight. Well, this way, one of the two sets of them is going to be able to make the move. I can't even blow up that thing intentionally. Damn. Ah, but he wastes his shot. I love those sentries, because they're just, like, great decoys. Really? Oh, come on. Ah! Alright, that does 200 damage. Mario can get to this pipe. Can dash into him. Sit right here to finish him off. Goodbye. Nicely done. I think everyone came out of that with 100% health, too. So that's even better, because here's Bowser Jr., and we're probably going to get a mini-boss. And it's the mech. Yep, should have seen that one coming. All that technology, and you still have a only single two-claw or two-digit pincer. You could have like a much more handy like hand. Oh, now you got a cow hammer. Mecha Junior, Junior's favorite birthday gift. All right. Oh, and it's the exact same field we were just on. Oh, shit. With the things that are revealed that... Oh, that's not great. Alright, um, he has a sentry. And he has a magnet dance. Oof. So just staying out of range of his hammer is not going to be enough. He also has two Valkyries protecting him. Alright, well, this is time to split left and right and circle back around behind him, because we do not want to have all three of us grouped together. Now, dashes aren't going to be effective against the boss. So this comes down to actually being able to lay down a lot of damage every turn. It's a mini boss, so it's a one life boss. Whereas a boss would have, you know, three lives. Okay, um, hmm. She has a good heal and has the sentry, is able to lay down some decent damage and tank. We're gonna keep her. I think we might bring Luigi in. Because his high mobility movement... Eh, I don't know. Outer Shell plus the Grenade Duck. Yeah, I think Rabbit Yoshi is the better secondary here. So we have a heal. And a heal that's not reliant on the Vampire. Let's get Rabbit... Wow, your Rabbit Yoshi has not been updated in a little while. All right. Well, the dashes aren't going to be quite as useful in this. 
movement is... Making ourselves absolutely invulnerable to things will be useful. Uh, cleanse jump is still going to be useful. Dash power we still want. I don't know if we're going to need... No, there's only three enemies on the field, so I don't think we're going to need extra dashes. Let's get the Scaredy Rabbids uh, range of effectiveness up. And... We don't have any height advantage, so I think that's good. Um, let's make sure we have Rabid Mario, or Rabid Luigi, or, ah, better chance against Hoppers. Does a little bit more damage. I mean, and right after this, we're going to, uh, get some more abilities, so I don't know. Yeah, we don't really, it's not that much damage that we can upgrade, so let's do it. Oh shit, you get to go first? Oh boy. No, don't do the dance. Okay, Sentry's fine. That's not fair that he gets to move first. He's got 2,000 health. And he's got shielders. Well, it doesn't reduce the damage I take. All right, well, that thing I can just run from all battle, so I'm not too concerned with wasting shots on it, but it's going to absorb my uh, hero sight. Ah, kind of wish I hadn't reduced some of those. We have a duck shot on that guy, or we just shoot Bowser Jr. directly. Could just soak this thing's damage with uh, Yoshi. Right, how far can Rabbit? Uh, how far can Mario go? How far can he go? Hmm. Gonna get hammered. Someone's gonna get hammered regardless. So, because we know we're gonna get hammered. Let's say... let's go right. Mario, how far can you go to the right? Why, why are these boxes missing? Ah, oh, shit. Okay, we can do this. We have two shield abilities. Uh, how far was Mario able to go to the right? Okay, he can go to the middle middle. Try to stay a little bit out of range. But we can show we can shield ourselves. Then we can sit here, which would put us in full cover and let us flank one of the Valkyries. Now, to ensure the sentry doesn't waste any of Mario's overlaunch shots, we can activate our shield. Makes us immune to all damage. And just run in for the hit. Zero damage. Uh, we'll wait on Rabbit Yoshi's shot. So let's use Mario, see if we can get the bounce on one of the Paladins. Or Valkyries, not Paladins. Okay, we did not. Might be able to blow this guy up. Ooh. 
There's zero percent, but that'll get me get him inked. And that will cause the ink to explode. Yeah, let's do this one. Oh, those are vampire boxes. Aha, you wasted your hammer. It did nothing. Okay, apparently you can do the hammer twice. So he has a reactive hammer, maybe? Oh, God. Uh, that's bad. That's very bad. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. That's not good at all. We lost Rabbit Yoshi already. Okay, this has just made this mini-boss fight much, much more difficult. That makes it a little bit easier. All right, we got one of them dead. But now we're down to two heroes fighting, so uh, that has greatly diminished our ability to do damage. Luckily, he is at the edge of our range, so... He's immune to the ink effect. Yep, so he does run towards whoever hits him. I see. Well, I wish I'd known that before I'd lobbed that grenade earlier. I should be okay? No, he has a two-square melee. So that means I can actually get hit there. Shit. Alright, that means I want to move with her first. But I want to shoot and then move. I can't hit the other guy. Okay, um, let's just not shoot at Bowser with her then. Damn it, if that, uh, that a grenade explosion hadn't have hit Bowser... We would have been pretty okay. Uh, can I get the tactical view up? Thank you. Lock. Um, with a 1-2 range, it cannot. I cannot be hurt by Bowser Jr., except he's going to use his call ability. All right, let's just get the other guy dead. That did not even kill him. I wonder if heal can revive a knocked out character. Yep, there's the draw. Shit. Well, luckily she... Wow, that's a lot of damage. This is a very, very mean mini-boss. Wow, um, I'm almost dead. Range? Are you kidding me? Well, we gotta heal first. Let's... What was my heal range? Ah, oh, damn it. I wouldn't have found out if that would have brought Yoshi back. Um, I think he's out for the round. Can't dash into this guy. Can kill this guy, though. Then, yeah, let's do this. Now we can play back. We don't need to use cover anymore. Okay, that's going to make next turn a little bit more unpredictable, but... anyone's going to be injured. We're definitely not doing this one under time. 
What's his movement range? Six. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, from the center. One, two, three, four, five, six, I guess. Two, three, four, five, six. So we should actually be okay from, like, here. We're gonna get hammered by with Mario. Shit. Because the sentry doesn't go first. Ah. Ow. Okay, this is a very, very hard boss battle. take a single shot at him. I think we might just kill Mario this turn. We're gonna have to see. It'd be real easy with a third character, but we're not getting that. We're just gonna put as much damage downrange this turn as we can get. Oh, that went towards Peach. Okay. Can he hit her this turn? No, she is one square out of range. Nice. All right. What? No. Oh, God damn it. All right, apparently he wasn't one square out of range. At least we'll be okay for the next turn. I think he's gonna maybe sentry here? Wait, he- oh yeah, sentry. Okay, I was gonna say he had a ranged attack. All right, we can kill him in one turn. Oh, I was hoping we'd get the heal done this turn, but we did not. Uh, we're gonna need one more turn to kill him. Oh, but he blew up his own sentry for us, and actually took damage while doing so. But we can't see him from here. Well, Mario's gonna die this turn, but Peach next turn will be able to kill him. Not the most well-handled mini-boss, but, uh... I think we did okay under the circumstances. The shield doesn't make a damn bit of difference at this point, but we'll do it.
This is a really, really mean mini boss. Holy shit. Honestly, I think Luigi might be good in this one because he could send his sentries through the pipes as well to mess with him. Well, we blew up his Mac at least. Yay! Yoshi saved him! Ah, uh, the famous Yoshi, and with Spawny no less, Fortune has finally smiled upon us. Which means shit's gonna get real hard. But we got to celebrate, Bowser Jr. could be back any second. We need to get Spawny out of here now. So Yoshi, is you true you have your own island? <laughs> Stand back, don't frighten him. Spawny, are you alright? <laughs> yes, well, we're glad to see you too. Ah, well, I suppose you have unleashed a swath of awe-inspiring destruction across the Mushroom Kingdom, thanks to your reckless handling of the Super Merge. Er, um, but as colossal disasters go, this one was, er, not so bad. <laughs> Let's see here, the positives are, mm, <laughs> Yes, the Sherbert Desert was cool, plus now we know all how, we all know how to spell Sherbert. Boy, was that a surprise. <laughs> Or Sherbet? Sherbet? I don't know. Three turns! They expect me to kill him in three turns. Wow. We didn't even get a good on that battle. We got a fair. Holy shit. Well, that'll be one I'll have to keep repeating to figure out how to do it, right? Now we have Yoshi. We have, so he has a minigun and a bazooka, it looks like. And a hero sight. Nice. Hero sight with a minigun? He's gonna be a main one. We got new weapons. And we got the start of a new chapter. Oh, didn't mean to start the new chapter. Um, but yeah. Uh, I think this is a good place to call it for now. So, uh, leave a like if you guys enjoyed. That was, a. Uh, Hopefully, okay, but boss battle. Leave a comment if you had a better idea of what team would work for that. Because I'm, I'm thinking uh, Rabbit Peach, or yeah, Rabbit Peach and uh, Luigi, because they could keep throwing sentries through the pipes. Which, well, I guess the pipes wouldn't draw, well, that would draw him towards where they are, and then they could jump through the pipes and just keep cheesing it that way, maybe? I don't know. But give me ideas and tips that you have for that, and uh, I'll deal with uh, the rest of this chapter next time. So, see ya.